What's up guys, Tom Dunn and Vale for your February newsletter update. Uh, February has been great, actually, since the beginning of the year, our business has picked up. November, December was pretty quiet for us and January, right after the holidays, it's like somebody just turned the faucet on here. I, as I talk with uh, my broker buddies from around the country, some of you guys are watching, uh, we've heard the same thing that activities definitely picked up. I was just at a Sotheby's event last night in Denver and the market's definitely picked up there as well. So historically Denver's quiet during the holidays. We're typically busy, um, so it was a little odd not being busy, but since the beginning of the year, it's definitely picked up. We're, um, we're doing great. So really excited to share that news. We've got a bunch of closings coming up. Um, you've seen us talk about uh, 1769 Alpine Drive, a little vintage um, piece of history there in Vail. That was a fun project. Um, true testament to the team, our system, our processes what it takes to really get a home listed. That one was pretty unique, had some, was old, and um, definitely had some issues that we had to get out in front of and get cleaned up. And really happy to report that that was under contract in two days, full price, uh, multiple offer situation. So lots of interest around that one. That was a fun project and um, we represented the buyer. So hit it home for our, um, for our seller. So really happy to report that. Um, market update is as I said, we're busy um, putting stuff under contract, showing property, still struggling with low inventory, values continue to hold, um, which is, it, it's kind of a little bit of an anomaly. Um, it's a testament to our Vail Valley market. I, I tell people all the time that this market has made me look like a hero because people buy here because they want to be here. It's obviously a lifestyle choice for many. Um, and we've got a great little happy valley here that, a lot of people want a piece of. Um, as we wrap up 2023 and going over the numbers, overall volume, total total tip to tail transactions for the Vail Valley just settled in just over $3 billion. It was $3.5 billion for 2022. So we're down 500 million from the previous year, but values continue to hold. So average price points up, our average sale price for single family homes up. I think we're right at 2 million now for, you know, average. Um, overall transactions were down, volume was down, but prices have continued to either hold or continue to climb in some neighborhoods, those neighborhoods that are most desirable with very low inventory. So volume down, prices up. And as we move into the spring, um, I feel like there's, we're getting a nice tailwind. Feels like consumer confidence is up. As we all know, interest rates are trickling down and those will continue to come down and overall um, confidence in the market. So we had a great 2023. Um, we finished uh, number 10 in all of Live. So for Live Colorado, we were um, Danielle, myself and now Gina, we finished at 10 and for the Vail MLS, I think we finished at either six or seven. So super happy about that. Thank you, thank you. Tom Dunn and Vail, wouldn't be Tom Dunn and Vail without you guys. So I appreciate your support. And um, we look forward to another good year. We're off to a good start. So there's your February update. As always, if you're in Vail, hit me up. Let's grab dinner, drinks, or make some runs. And um, we're looking forward to spring. So. Until next time, Tom Dunn and Val.